This nugget is about the skeleton. In this nugget, we are going to identify and describe the role of the skeleton and name some of the main bones in the human body. The keywords we're going to use include skeleton, bone, skull, shoulder blade, collarbone, ribs, pelvis, thigh bone, kneecap, and spine, also known as the backbone. So what is a skeleton? Your skeleton is made up of lots of bones all joined together. Throughout your life, your skeleton is growing inside your body as you grow. Many different animals have skeletons too. For example, you should remember that vertebrates are animals that have a backbone or a spine. Here we have a skeleton of a dog. It looks slightly different to a human skeleton, but because we're both mammals, there are similarities too. Functions. What do you think we need our skeleton for? The skeleton is very important. It does three main jobs. The skeleton gives support as it holds our body and organs in place and works with our muscles to keep us upright or in different positions. The skeleton is important for movement. Muscles attached to the skeleton and the skeleton can then bend at joints to allow you to move around. Protection. The skeleton is made up of hard bones, so the skeleton can protect your vital organs, including your brain, your lungs and your heart. Labelling the skeleton. Here we have a human skeleton. Did you know that the adult human skeleton has 206 bones? Don't worry, you don't need to know the names of 206 different bones. We're just going to go through a few. Can you name any of them already? At the top of our skeleton we have the skull. The skull protects the brain, a bit like a helmet does when you put it on top of your head. In the middle of our body we have the ribs. The ribs form a cage around your organs in the middle of your body protecting the heart and lungs. Your shoulder blade is slightly behind the ribs and helps your shoulders and arms move. Your collarbone helps support the weight of your arms and it goes across your chest all the way out to your shoulders. Did you know that humans have 12 pairs of ribs that form a cage around the organs? Whereas snakes can have between 200 and 400 ribs. Next, we're going to label the spine or the backbone. The spine supports the whole body and runs from the bottom to the top behind the rib cage. Remember, vertebrates all have a spine or backbone. The pelvis is a fairly large bone that attaches the lower and upper parts of the skeleton. The thigh bone is actually your longest and strongest bone in the body. It helps support and move the whole body. Your kneecaps are another bone that helps your leg bend at the knee. Summary. In summary, a skeleton is made up of lots of different bones joined together. Humans and animals have slightly different skeletons inside their bodies, with some things in common, like vertebrates all having a backbone or spine. The three main roles of the skeleton are support, movement and protection. The key words we used were bone, which is the hard white stuff that makes up your skeleton. Skeleton, the different types of bones joined together inside your body. And then we labelled our skeleton using the words skull, shoulder blade, collarbone, ribs, pelvis, thigh bone, kneecap and spine.